the people who targeted you are so scared of you now. They're so scared. And it's not even that they're scared of you. They're scared of God. Because these people did not believe in God. They did not believe in karma. They didn't believe that you were someone worthy of protection. And you may have been somebody who was a loner your whole life. You didn't really have a lot of people around you. They never saw people defend you. They never saw people come to your side and protect you the way that you should have been protected. And because of this, they thought you were an easy target. You, they thought you were free range to torment and talk down on and belittle. They wanted you to be scared of them. They wanted you to be scared to leave your house. They wanted you to be scared to live and chase your dreams and chase your goals. They didn't want you to see yourself for who you really are, the way the Holy Spirit and the Most High God saw you this entire time. But now the tables have turned because now those people are scared. Now those people are frightened. And now those people, those wannabe big bad predators that wanted you to be prey, now they feel preyed on. And now they feel preyed on by something that they can't even see, an energy they cannot even see, all right? There's a quote that says, you are protected by an energy that this world is not prepared to deal with. That is you. You are protected by something that cannot be seen with the human eye. They felt like because you did not have people around you in the physical realm protecting you, or they thought you didn't have people around in the physical realm protecting you, that everything was just okay and they were going to be able to have their way with you not understanding that behind the scenes the entire time the most high god and the holy spirit and your angels and your ancestors had their hands on you even when it didn't feel like they had their hands on you they did okay they were just waiting for the correct moment to act and now is the time that they are acting on your behalf because they saw how gracefully you handled your enemies and how you remained faithful on your divine mission and stayed focused and decided that you were gonna let God handle your battles for you, okay? And now, since you allow God to handle your battles for you, big God is about to handle your enemies for you, okay? Your enemies are being handled as we speak, whoever this message is for. They are being handled. They may have already been handled. You may have already witnessed the things that have happened to these people who did not believe in you. They didn't believe in karma. They thought they could do whatever they wanted to to you. And now they're finding out that's not the case. You are not to be touched. You are not to be messed with, okay? The tables have now turned. The pendulum has now swung the other way. And it's not fun anymore. It's not funny anymore. When they were tormenting you, it was funny. They were having a great time at your expense. And now they're about to find out who God really is and how God does not play about you.